ladies and gentlemen, the President of the United States. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Well, I'm delighted that the great number of you that are able to be here as we pay honor, which we're very pleased to do to you, the members of the Conference of Republican Mayors and Municipal Elected Officials. And I understand that, uh, speaking of numbers, that as a percentage of the total number, you are much greater than just a short time ago. <laughs> Pleased with that. We've accomplished a lot working together. And as I said Wednesday night, uh, America is back. I noticed the press has decided that's a campaign slogan. I never thought of it as anything. But <laughs> I just thought it was the truth. <laughs> but, um, you know, I, I won't give you a litany of figures because since Wednesday night and some speeches that I made yesterday, you'd have to be living under a rock not to have heard by now that inflation is down to 3.2 and the prime rate has been cut in half, unemployment is dropping at the fastest rate in 33 years, so I won't say that. <laughs> I, uh, I had four million jobs last year. <laughs> But um, you've told me that things of this kind and some of what we've done has been of help to you, and yet we all know that the problems still remain, many problems. You certainly have them. And uh, you know also that for these three years we've tried to restore more autonomy to other levels of government that has been absorbed in the past by the federal government. And we've had some success, but I don't think we will ever have met our full responsibility at this level of government until all those functions that properly belong in the hands of state and locally elected officials are put back there with full autonomy and the sources of revenue which the federal government has preempted over the years are returned to you for the funding of those particular responsibilities. Now, in the past three years, Mayor George Israel has been tremendously helpful to me in serving as your president. George, where are you? Uh, George, come here just a second. It's just a little thing. I didn't trust the mails and didn't want to get an envelope. But I want to congratulate you on a very successful year, but also it's uh, with gratitude that Mr. President. I recognize what you've done to be of help. Thank you. You don't know how much I appreciate it. Only Republican mayor in Georgia, and I was in Georgia yesterday, and he was here. <laughs> but um, now, I'd like also to congratulate Mayor Bob Isaac. Where? Well, as you all know, he assumes that job of president now, and it's my hope that in the first year of your term, we can present to you the Enterprise Zones legislation, which has been up on the hill for the last two years. All right. We'll do our best. Well, I thank all of you for the many sacrifices that you've made and for all that you've done to be a support to us and what we've been trying to do here in these, these three years. And uh, we had said that we were going to make a new beginning, and uh, I think we have, thanks to you and to all the people that you represent, and we're going to we'll keep on working down along that path. And now I understand I'm going to have a chance to greet each one of you individually and get our pictures taken, so I'll run and get on my tape mark in there. <laughs> <laughs> <Thank you. laughs>